The first part of their job wasn't easy, bringing together 12,000 human skeletons from every region of Turkey. Researchers then took them to the country's first lab devoted to the study of ancient DNA. They hope their testing and analysis will give them insights into human life going back as far as 10,400 BC. To understand the past, we have divided it into different time periods and we're analyzing the differences among them. The one thing we've been focusing on over the last few years is the transition between hunter-gatherers to farmers. We consider it important to understand the change when human beings began making and building things. The study of ancient DNA first started in Europe in the late 20th century. But research there has failed to shed light on this critical turning point in human history. We still simply don't know when and why people began to settle down. And the work at the lab at Hacettepe University in Ankara aims to fill in those gaps. This kind of research here at Huspiel requires a sophisticated and comprehensive look at ancient DNA. This is why this work also requires a special kind of environment. First, the DNA must be extracted from specimens. It's best preserved inside the bone at the base of the skull, the hardest and densest bone in the human body. Ancient DNA labs have certain standards. Positive pressure airflow, precautions and measures to prevent contamination are key. The contamination of ancient DNA with modern DNA will hinder our work. The genetic material of the samples is then mapped and analyzed. These scientists believe their study of DNA from a wide range of people and time periods could answer questions about our ancient history, so we can better understand where we come from and how we got here. Yasin Ekan, TRT World, Ankara.